Wolves to Chelsea 6. What a demolition job by Chelsea. The first half of the contest, right? Chelsea scores, Wolves equalize. 1-1. Chelsea makes it 2-1. Wolves makes it 2-2 at the dying embers of the, of the first half. Second half, the gap in performance and in outcome was nice and dead. I know it. Absolute bomb of a defender. The left side of Wolves' defense is pathetic. Now, is it to make that excuse? The left part, can, the left side, and uh, left part of the Wolves can be actually is also all, actually horrible. But it's, it's another thing for Chelsea to take full advantage of it. None is day. Pretty much, we saw that uh, Instagram status story where he said Wolverhampton was shite. Right? And he, he he came under a bit of scrutiny for that for that uh, uh, I, he can call it a tweet for that post which he deleted, but yet he came on the pitch and he delivered scoring a hat trick, and Kopama having a hat trick of assist, and scoring his own goal to make it a uh, to make it three two. So all around we can debate whether Chelsea will make top four, whether Chelsea can maintain or sustain this performance. But let's give them their kudos and their full credit for today's performance. It was a starting. Especially the second half, they came out like a house on fire and they took Wolves to the cleaners. Wolves could not live up with Chelsea in the second half. Like I said, in the first half, it was a bit of a contest back and forth. Chelsea scores, Wolves equalize. Chelsea scores again, Wolves equalize. But in the second half, it was like night and day. And Ignori is the bomb of a defender. It's so pathetic. Stuff. A few years ago, Arsenal fans wanted this guy. Even though we could see Ignori going forward. Fantastic. But defensively, absolute liability. Worse than Zinchenko. Worse than Zinchenko. So, shout out to Chelsea. Congratulations to uh, Madweke for that fantastic hat trick. He deserves it. Congratulations to Kopama on, the, on, the, on this performance. That fantastic uh, assist for the hat trick for, for what was the Madweke and scoring his own goal. So, all around, Chelsea deserve your credit. Attacking wise, Chelsea look very very good but that midfield and that defense is suspect now like i said they look great in this in this game and they deserve their plaudits and their full credit many games and many other teams will not afford you this space they will not afford you this luxury so enjoy the victory enjoy the hat trick of assist and goals by noni and kopama but you still need to be objective and say there are a few knots and bolts to tighten especially in the defense and the midfield. Wolves almost made it 6-3, six six right? The Lovina goal was canceled for offside. And at the then embers of the second half, we saw the lapse of concentration from Cowell that almost gave the ball to the striker of a Wolves, who, who actually dragged it wide. So there are a few concerns and lapses of, of concentration when it comes to Chelsea defensively. And in that midfield, they need to tighten up physically and be more creative. But offensively, we saw Jao Felix score in his second debut, coming back to Chelsea, right? He scored a goal today. Offensively, Chelsea are flying. Kopama dictating and run, run, running, running riot. Uh, we saw Noni today. We saw, even though Nicholas Jackson is not prolific, he does his stuff attacking well. But that defense and that midfield, that is where Chelsea need to tighten up. And let's see how the the sitting of will they, will they tighten up? Now, based on his performance, they look very scary. I, I, what that what the mainstream will say in the YouTube world, but I still have my concern. But I'm going to give them full credit for this performance. Ecstatic. It was a fantastic performance from Chelsea. They deserved their six goals, uh, but they considered two. So to be fair, uh, like I said, first half of the context, second half, they blew Wolves away. So let's see how it progresses. Does that mean they'll, they'll make top four? Let's see. I will make that final decision later regarding me adjusting my predictions but based on this performance do they see any the striker you tell me in the comment section do you think Chelsea is the striker based on this performance yeah I don't think a striker is Chelsea's uh problem for lack of a better term I just think that midfield is not as solid even though they've invested so much in that midfield financially and defensively they are not solid so for me is the defense at the midfield the attack will actually flourish we saw them scoring six goals today because it's always easy it's, it's a lazy argument to say it's the attack all the time sometimes your attack will not score but don't concede and sometimes you just score one or two goals make sure you don't concede if you can tighten up defensively 
and find a way to score, you will still win games. So let me know what you think in the comment section. One more time, Noni is going to hat trick. Fantastic for him. Kuopama having hat trick of assist, of assist. Congratulations, assist going one goal. So makes it four uh, goal contributions for Kuopama. Fantastic. And Enzo Maresca, a bit of his signature and science showed on, on, on this game in isolation. So let's see how this signature of change on, in just approach can be sustained. So let me know what you think about this performance and the goals in the comment section. Has that changed your uh, how you see Chelsea or you still think this is a one-off by Chelsea? Let me know in the comment section. On your way out, uh, be kind enough to like the video. Very, very important. And if you're new here, do not forget to subscribe to the channel and make sure you turn on your notification bell one more time. Like the video, subscribe if you're new, and do not forget to turn on your notification. Chelsea ripping into Wolves at the moment. New six goals to two. Hard trick of gold by Noni Madrike. Kopama scoring one goal and three assists. And uh, what's his name? Joe Felix scoring on the, on his second debut at Chelsea. So, guys, do the needful, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye for now. <laughs>